Tonight, Kemper County is being impacted by the heavy rainfall throughout the county. Twin States News Celeste Smith shows us the damage. The damage from the rain was reported around 9.30 a.m. Two of the closures are on Allen Road and Neely Road, where some of the roads have begun to give way. Well, we got certain roads that are in low-lying areas or near creek beds, and most of the water had risen so high that it then flooded the roads out. And on one road, Allen Road, it actually then wiped out a cover, making a big hole in the road, where then pushed all the soil and pavement off. So we had to close that road down earlier. County officials were made aware of this issue thanks to a resident. The dent that noticed it that morning, we went up there and immediately shut down the road, put up barricades, and uh, started accessing the damage to see what plan we're going to put in place to repair the roads. The county will begin planning road repairs as soon as the rain stops. We have to uh, wait first until the rain stops and it dry up, and then our county engineer and road manager come up with a plan and they um, put it together and repair the road, whether it be putting in a new bridge. Uh, hauling dirt or else or putting in coverage, just whichever way we can to repair. But sometimes it takes a while to repair. The Kemper County Sheriff's Department is advising residents to pay attention to the road closure signs and to not drive past them. In Kemper County, I'm Celeste Smith with Twin States News.